This is a simple tutorial in Blender 2.71 on rendering cycles gold material using an HDRI image. I'm just going to use a random HDRI image I found on the internet. You can just do a Google search for HDRI images and find plenty. It doesn't necessarily have to be an HDRI image, just the higher the resolution I've found, the better it works. I'm going to do this as an image texture and not an environmental texture, though I suggest if you have multiple objects like joined together or linked together, uh, try both. Try the environmental texture, sometimes it turns out better. So let's get started. I'm going to get rid of our default cube and I'm going to add the monkey. Now we're just going to do some scene setup here real fast, so I'm not going to go through any of this. Basically just getting a nice camera view. Get some lighting. The lighting is not going to be perfect, but enough to do what we're trying to do. Now I want this to be a little bit smoother, so I'll add some subdivision, set it to smooth, and then cycles render up here at the top. And let's get started. I'm going to set my world for kind of a black background. And I'm going to turn on rendering. Now let's set up our material. Go over here to the Materials tab and open it up. Select New. Under the Surface, we're going to select Mix Shader. And then for our two shaders here, we're going to select Glossy for the first, Diffuse for the second, and then under the Glossy Shader, I'm going to change the roughness down to about a 0 .82. 0 .85 will work. Anywhere in the 0 .08 range has worked out pretty good for me. Uh, the diffuse roughness I'm going to set to about 0 .02. Then here under the diffuse shader color, right here on the side, just click on this image texture. You'll notice this all turned purple. We're going to open. I'm going to find my HDRI image. This one is uh, City Night Lights, so maybe you can Google that if you want to use this one. Then under the vector, down here under our diffuse shader, we're going to change that to reflection. Under our displacement down here, change that to reflection ray. And under our glossy color, we're going to make it a nice gold tint. Now this is pretty dark, so we're going to go up here and select our lamp, use nodes. I'm going to change my strength to about oh, 1500. Now we have a nice gold look to our monkey. Now you'll notice if I pull in on it, there's some artifacts here. They call these lightning bugs. One of the best ways to get rid of those, the most you can do for it, other than moving your lighting and setting up lighting, I'm going to go under my render tab, go to light paths, and select no caustics, and that really cuts down on your, your lightning bugs. Now personally for render settings myself, just like the HD TV 1080p and set my sampling for 36. We're not going to go too heavy on this. And then we'll render it. And we have a nice gold material we can apply. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped somebody out. And happy blending.